Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, we are going to be looking at X for Records Serum, namely its curves. It has a lot of curves, and who does not like curves? And they are everywhere in this modulation matrix, and they will essentially go on forever. What do they do? I'll kind of explain. And it comes from like, you know, looking at the same piece of software every day for five years, and you're just like, hey, what's that do? Well, that's kind of the moment that I had, and I'm going to share it with you. So, Pretty self-explanatory. I'll give you uh, an example right off the bat. Uh, I have a basic patch here, the init preset, which is my favorite. And I'm going to hit mono and then legato and then have always for porta and then the porta time like this, so. And it's going to glide from one note to another like so. And it glides in a very linear way. Well, we can adjust the curve of that so it'll kind of uh, slowly snap towards where it is and then slowly settle to the end note like so. Or the opposite, it will kind of slowly stay at the note it was and then snap up to the note that it is. All right, we're adjusting the, uh, the, the curve of that and how it reacts. So that's all well and good. How does this apply to the modulation matrix? Well, you can take a source, say a LFO or an envelope, and change the curve of how it affects the uh, modulation destination. So I'll, I'll give you an example, and I'll give you an example visually. What it does for those that are curious and they don't want to wait to hear how it works is it will effectively take an LFO like this and depending on what you do will make it look like that or like that even though it's like this it'll make it change it from linear to curved hence the curves and that is one of the use cases for it um, also you can make a particular envelope affect many things and it'll make things more snappier than others so you know you only have three envelopes you can make it seem like you have 28.8 envelopes uh, and I'll give you an example of that so I have an envelope 2 here and I'll have that mapped to the cutoff and just have like an arbitrary kind of amount going down like this and then I'll have uh, the same envelope affecting the drive. So now it's like this. But let's say I want to have the drive like really fast at the beginning. Um, well, I could make another envelope and do that and have like a snappier one and compare these two, the little, the little shadow of envelope two in the background. But let's not do that. Let's actually go into the modulation matrix because we're super duper cool. And I'll make this more snappy by adjusting the curve. Or no, adjusting the curve. So that filter drive, if we were to look at it in slow motion by increasing the decay, this the filter drive is more snappy and the filter cutoff is more smooth. And that's not a magic trick. I don't have anything up my sleeve or anywhere else. This is the same envelope but we have different kind of timings and how it's affected. And this is with curves and it's exceptionally useful um, once you start using it. Um, you know, you can have multiple LFOs, you can change the shape and linearity of LFOs, kind of make them more like like so, or what have you. You can have smoother ramps and things like that. But yeah, that's just a, another kind of, I guess, sound design tip. Um, I've always known about curves. I never really used them, but uh, I'm just like, hmm, how can I use them? Well, this is kind of how you use them. If you want to have very complex sound design, you can do this and have multiple ones. So let's say you want to have envelope one. Or no, 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 we'll have, we'll have envelope three, like the other one. And I want this uh, mapped to... Let's say, yeah, like, uh, let's say, say white noise. I can have envelope to map to white noise. So I can save an envelope of a snappy, really short white noise thing by repeating myself and uh, doing this.
And there you have it. Anyway, you know, Serum is just one of those plugins that keeps on giving. It's like Christmas. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I am sleep deprived. I'm going to have a nap. Take care and have a good one.